amid the violence that has been occurring in Manipur. Uh, here in Shillong, we have the Catholic Association who has organized a peace rally which uh, kicked off from Madan Yoringhem and will assemble here in uh, Don Bosco ground. You can see scores of people have turned up for this peace rally, people from all walks of life, students from different communities, from different uh, states have all come together and they're all carrying placards uh, urging for peace and normalcy to be revived in the state of Manipur. The rally assembled at the Don Bosco Mini Stadium and saw the participation of thousands, including students, church leaders, academicians, youth leaders, social activists, politicians, and many more. Here, prayer services to restore peace in Manipur were carried out by church leaders. We have uh, people from all walks of life and we have seen several students who have come forward to participate in this peace rally, uh, praying for peace in Manipur. I'm being joined by one of the students here. Your name please? Anisha uh, Dhan. You're a student of St. Anthony's. Uh, today, why is it that you have decided to be part of this peace rally? Uh, because there has been a lot of things going on in Manipur and if we can do a little bit for them then it will be really great. And sexually Along with you, you also have other students here from the same uh, school. Uh, what is it that you feel is required? Like what is the need of the hour for Manipur? I think the government should take precautions and also they should do something instead of looking at other things. They should help the poor people and especially the women and like children because they are facing a lot of problems in Manipur. I'm pretty sure that you also have friends from Manipur, have you been in touch with them? How are they at the moment? Um, they are fine, but then the situation is really, really bad. It's like it has been happening for so many months. So, yeah. Thank you so much. What about you? What do you have to say about the violence that has been occurring in Manipur? Uh, it's very sad to see what's happening in Manipur. So I'd like to say that the voices that can be heard and that should be empowered and they should just put an end to the violence so that everybody can be at peace. Thank you so much. So here we have students who feel that uh, you know peace is needed in the state of Manipur. It's uh, been more than three months now that uh, Manipur has been suffering. This peace rally that we have witnessed has been organized by the Catholic Association uh, of Shillong and we have seen not only students, not only working uh, male or female participating in this rally, uh, it is also several students who have gathered here at Don Bosco's uh, Don Bosco ground to uh, participate in this peace rally praying for peace. Another student being joined here from St. Edmunds, right? Yes. Your name please? Uh, my name is Thang Lin Hao Anthony Tautang. Okay. And uh, how many years have you been here in Shillong? It's actually been two and a half months only. Months, okay. Uh, what do you think is really happening in Manipur? What needs to be done? What is uh, required for Manipur right now? Well, I, th I think what's re really required is to stop the state from interfering in the matters now. Right now what we need is intervention from the central government. If the central government interferes, the state can no longer interfere in these matters, the violence. Therefore, if the state no longer has power, that means peace, can, uh, peace is uh, not a far cry. It can prevail. But right now, because the state has power, it's really difficult for peace to come about because, as we can see, armories are looted, weapons stolen, but the CM has said nothing about this. So we can see that there is some sort of play going on behind the scenes. So the state government is what, fail, is, what is failing the country right now, or our people. The so you feel that President's rule is the very much need of the arm? Yes, very much. Mainly because the violence won't stop unless President's rule is imposed, or even if our demands are met, there will still be violence. So the thing that we need to do the most right now is let the CM step down. I think that's the best option.
earlier the Catholic Association of Shillong, which is affiliated with the All India Catholic Union, had mentioned that the organization will petition President Draupadi Murmu on the Manipur violence. A memorandum to the President calling for her immediate attention to the prolonged ethnic violence in Manipur was addressed during the rally. The memorandum will be submitted through Governor Phagu Chauhan. Political leaders like TMC President Charles Pingrope, Congress leader Ronnie V. Lingdo and several others took part in the peace rally. In this peace rally, not only students but also political leaders. I'm being joined by uh, TMC leader ba Charles Pingrop. Uh, sir, this peace rally has been organized. We see you are part of it. What do you think is required for Manipur right now? Well, you have heard in all our prayers by the religious leaders and the and the memorandum that has been submitted going to be submitted to the governor and the president explains clearly that we need peace in Manipur and through peace and dialogue can only uh, normalcy prevail therefore it is very important that whatever what we have done today as a community across all religious lines we have come together to pray for peace and to pray for the people of Manipur and let better sense prevail so that there is no more hardships and no more burden on the people and the local people. Also uh, talking about you know what is needed, do you think President's rule is very much need of the hour? Uh, what's your opinion? Well, I'm, I'm not the most competent authority to decide on that, but I believe uh, I believe if the if uh, a collective decision is taken and ensure that if they want normalcy, there has to be there has to be a proper governance and system. And if that is absent, then the only alternative is president's rule. Thank you so much, sir. And that was the TMC leader, Bar Charles Pungro, who spoken and mentioned that uh, peace is the need of the hour, is what is required in the state of Manipur. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to East Mojo. For any queries, put them down in the comments section below and press on the bell icon for notifications.